to hashtag exterior channel please support us with like and subscribe and turn on notifications if you want to see interior designs check our channel hashtag deco garden landscaping ideas ways to plan the perfect yard space from scratch you can landscape a garden and still stay on budget create a stunning outdoor space that works for you using the best materials planting schemes and landscaping methods you enhance your yard in all seasons our guide to garden landscaping is a sound starting point when transforming your outdoor space from scratch whether you are burrow or total novice because creating a garden that is beautiful and satisfying is more than hazard a process and anyone who has successfully landscaped a garden in their time is sure to agree if you have come this far you are likely to be working on a garden in your forever home or at least in the place that you happily call home for now to really feel the benefits of your yard space it's go beyond tidying your lawn with the best lawn mower and you will need to follow some ground rules pun intended to ensure the most successful results how big you go with your landscaping ideas depends on your taste how many acres you have and of course your budget to save money while landscaping your garden while creating a garden that will actually thrive choose plants that are native to your area non-native plants are always gonna be more expensive and they will often require much more water and attention that they actually stay alive in the climate that they are not meant for you will also wanna pay attention to where your garden is gonna be located and how much sun it will get knowing the amount of sun that plants will be getting will help you choose specific native plants that serve with that exact amount of sunlight it's a case of working with your foundations so that your planting and other cosmetics finishes can fall into place far more attractively from wedding to ground living the best landscaping plants to use and which trees to consider these garden landscaping ideas and tips will set you up for success assess your site and your garden design this is a critical area that you should largely have covered when creating your garden design to understand the space you're working with. The main reason for this part of the garden landscaping process is that you will be looking to identify any issues so that you can prepare your efforts and materials accordingly, which will save you time and money in the long run. This is what to consider. Clear up. Is there any rubbish to remove? Ground condition. Will you need to level a bumpy lawn? Any awkwardly situated trees? Are they likely to obstruct walkways or get in the way of groundwork? Any exciting planting hedges? Consider garden flower beds and so on any exciting structure or features in place to remove work with think decks about you fencing garden rooms or features garden paths drainage understand the state of the space after a down bar noting any particular areas that become world logged topsoil 
analyze the current state of any exciting and whether any more will be required. Decide whether to die or hire a garden landscaper. The key here is to know your limits and your budget. Planting and installing of the big war features adding a new gravel path or lawn. Playing decking and garden fencing or within the scope of the kinometer, however, walling, laying expensive stone bearers, concrete rendering, and electric workshop be carried out by professionals for a quality safe finish, even if you do have a small plot. Clear the site. This means getting rid of weeds. Naturally, everyone's favorite job or using one of the best weed killers as well as any overgrowth and removing any garden waste. Visible rubbish is easy to remove by using a pick if the soil is compacted or a garden rake if you are lucky and distributing. The soil can help release any rubber to be removed below. This can be a tough job but it's completely necessary especially if you're planning for lots of planting and one to start a kitchen garden big chunks of rubble make it harder for plants to establish and can potentially block drainage access also determine whether this will be a light job and easy to do yourself if, or if you need to hire skip Level the ground. This is a vital task as without a level ground, any landscaping materials such as patio and decking can't go down. If you have a small garden space, then you may be able to level the ground yourself using a heavy duty garden or a local hardware stone. With the teeth. To break up large chunks of soil while the back can also be used to smooth the surface by running it in a forward and backward motion to evenly distribute the soil. If you have a big space where the soil is very compacted or if you are working with a very sloped garden then you may need to consider calling in a professional. A suitable change on level can help make a smaller yard or garden feel larger, but sloped grass is no no as it can become sleepy and sightly very quickly. Tracking is probably the best way to work with a sloped garden and it will allow you to have different levels of interest in your space. Select hard landscaping materials that will stand the test of time. Identifying and exploring potential materials is one of the more enjoyable parts of landscaping garden. Your choice of landscaping materials can have a big effect on the overall cost of your project. So it's worth being consequence of what you are using reposing goes a long way when it comes to landscaping with a budget find exciting stones, wood and plants that can be moved around instead of replacing everything all together. When it comes to stone and wood, go to local slash yards and warehouses to ask for excess plates of bricks and boards for the practical of their original price. Meanwhile, wait for clearance, sales at blind nurseries, and opt for blinds that can be divided and transported.